Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are located. Thank you all so much for joining Rail Bookers as today we experience Alaska by rail. First and foremost, just want to take a minute to introduce myself. My name is Jim Marini and will proudly be your presenter here today. Today we have a real treat in store for each and every one of you. And I did want to mention as I go through today's exciting presentation, any questions that you may have, folks, on the right-hand side of your screen is the question box. So please feel free to type in any questions and I will do my very best to answer as many as I can at the end of today's presentation. Folks, we have a huge audience in attendance today. So thank you all again very much. Today's presentation is scheduled to be about 30 to 45 minutes, give or take, with questions. So I hope you could join me all the way through. I did want to mention also, before we get started, folks, on the right-hand side in your question box, if you'd be so kind and just type in, folks, what great cities, towns, states, or countries, rather, are you joining in from? Where are you calling in from, folks? If you'd be so kind to give a little shout out of the great states and towns and cities and countries that you're calling it from. Feel free to type away. All right, here we go, folks. All right, I'm going to try to keep up with this. We have Cleveland, Ohio. We actually have another Cleveland. We have Providence, Rhode Island, Boca Raton, Florida, Dallas, Texas, North Bend, Oregon, San Antonio, Texas, Chicago, Illinois, Mississippi, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. I knew we'd have some folks from Canada. Manchester, New Jersey, another folks from Toronto, Canada, Massachusetts, San Diego, Utah, Southern California, another Oregon, Washington, Colorado. Keep them coming, everyone. This is fantastic. Vancouver, I knew it. There's another folk from north of the border. All right. Illinois, again, we have Indiana. We have Atlanta, Georgia, New Orleans. Fantastic. All right, folks. Well, thank you all so much for joining us. So with that in mind, let's get started. So for those of you who may not be as familiar with Rail Bookers, we are part of the Yankee Leisure Group family of brands. And if you look all the way to the left-hand side, I'm sure this is a name many of you will recognize. Yes, we are the official tour operator of Amtrak Vacation. So for any of you looking to travel locally, even for a quick little getaway weekend, uh, Amtrak Vacations, we can book everything from literally Rail Plus hotels, meals, sightseeing tours, activities. We have packages all put together, but any of them can be customized. We also operate Yankee Holidays. So for any of you also looking to stay local here in the US, as well as even Canada, once the borders open and you wanna do more of a road trip, a drive-in vacation, or maybe you wanna to fly to and from a particular new beautiful national park here in the continental United States, and all you need is lodging, sightseeing, tour, and a meal, Yankee Holidays has you covered. And of course, all the way to the right-hand side, our latest and greatest brand, which of course is the brand that operates Alaska by rail. This is Rail Bookers, which is our international brand as well. So not only Alaska by land and by rail, but also all throughout Canada, Europe, and around the world. So wanted to just start out with that. Now, why do so many travelers love Rail Bookers? Well, first and foremost, let me share this with all of you. Any of you that are looking to travel to Alaska or certainly anywhere around the world, you can travel as early as the late summer and fall of this year, all the way up to 24 months in advance. You can actually book your trips to plan to travel up to one to two years in advance. So many of the trips are bucket list experiences. So if any of you are celebrating a special birthday, a special anniversary, or for a special occasion, we got you covered. Freedom and flexibility. In many of our trips, especially when it comes to Europe, there's multiple departures daily and certainly throughout Canada as well as the U.S. It truly is the scenic way to travel. I always say any of us that fly, myself included, on airplanes, well, I think it's pretty safe to say the clouds look pretty similar wherever we fly anywhere around the world. So why not travel by rail? You could deposit now and pay later. In fact, on any of these trips to Alaska or any other trips, Deposits, it's only $250 per person, and you get to plan a trip of a lifetime. And final payment is not due until 90 days before departure. So if you're planning to travel in the next year, all that's due is just deposit before final payment, not until 90 days before departure. And you are able to make payments along the way, folks. So if that's easier for any of you to make payments with us or through your local travel advisor, 
you have the ability to do that. You could choose your own accommodations. In fact, we have a nice range of different hotels and lodges that we use. In any of these trips, not only in Alaska, but anywhere around the world can be customized. Again, the best highlight, especially if you're looking for a little quick getaway, and you want to just get out of the house, maybe you have a little cabin fever, uh, want to visit family and friends, you could travel literally within the next two days, two weeks, two months, up to two years in advance. Now, the nice part is we have support from all our global offices worldwide. I'm actually doing today's presentation from the Boston area. If you can hear a little bit of an accent, but we do have offices, yes, down under in Sydney, Australia, as well as London and Southern California, not to mention even over into Toronto, Ontario. Now, something we have going on right now that I think is fantastic, and I hope all of you do as well, it is called our maximum flexibility offer. I like to refer to this as our peace of mind offer. Folks, any new reservations that you make or any existing reservations that you have, as long as you book before the end of September of this year, okay, September 30th, with a small deposit of only $250 per person, you have the ability to change or postpone your trip for any reason whatsoever, as long as you or your travel advisor lets us know five days prior to whenever you're planning to depart. And guess what, folks? We are waiving any and all change and cancellation fees. So this is just our way of basically helping to support each and every one of you to be able to plan that trip of a lifetime, especially out to Alaska that has the majestic snow-capped mountains and so many of the great sites, not to mention Denali National Park. And then if you did need to change your dates for whatever reason, you have that maximum flexibility in order to do that, and we will waive any change or cancellation fees. Now, folks, there's so many reasons to travel through Alaska by land. You know, Alaska is one-fifth the size of the continental United States, all right? You get to stay in your own private cabins versus doing it as a day trip if you were traveling on a cruise. And I've obviously, as many of you may be aware, some of you may have even originally been planning to travel on a cruise, but no fault of the cruise lines. Many of them, unfortunately, are not operating. Well, that's what we have you covered. We are operating some of these Alaska trips all throughout and we got you some great options you can avoid a five-hour bus journey from some of the ports from the cruise lines out to beautiful denali national park all right you can create your own schedule now when's the most popular time to travel to alaska i'm going to get to that in just a minute and you truly see views that are not accessible by cruise. Now, what is the best time to travel to Alaska? Well, typically May through September. Um, most of our travelers will go typically June, July, August into September. Now, we are taking new reservations right now as we speak for so many clients looking to travel as early as the late summer and fall of this year. So if you maybe had a cruise that was originally planned, but it got canceled, if you just want to go out there, it's on your wish list, your bucket list, pick up that phone, give us a call, or contact your local travel advisor. By the way, we are open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Now, there's so many great reasons why to take the train. Do you know this year, 1.4 million people were expected to travel to Alaska this year? All right, and if you look, obviously, as I mentioned, when you travel by land, you truly get in-depth you get inside of Alaska um, and you don't have to worry about being back on the ship at a certain time. You get to spend extra time and, and in many cases overnight in some of these magnificent areas. Now we do have some great specials going on on some of our different Alaska specials where you can save up to $300 per couple. All right, so if you wanna learn more, just give us a call or contact your travel advisor. All right, if you take a look folks, this is Alaska Railroad. If you look at the right-hand side of the picture. This is a map of the train journeys themselves. Now, something to keep in mind, Alaska Railroad is traveling through Alaska by day. There is no overnight travel on board the train. Now, there's two iconic train routes. One is called the Coastal Classic. Folks, this is gonna take you from Anchorage, as you can see right there towards the bottom on the right-hand side, down to Seward. This is the Southern route called the Coastal Classic. Classic. And then the other route that's also extremely popular actually goes in the opposite direction. This is called the Denali Star. This goes from Anchorage, as you can see, but travels north all the way up to Denali and then even all the way up to Fairbanks. And again, it's travel by day. 
they operate one train per day in either direction so it really is a fantastic experience now there's two different types of class now all our pricing is based in adventure class that's what you're looking at right here and adventure class is a great class of service you have seat reservations it's also open class to the vista dome that's what you're looking at on the bottom left hand corner all right wilderness cafe where you can purchase meals um, also bar services available they do have tour guides that rotate throughout the different adventure classes. So this is what our packages are based on, is adventure class. Now folks, I'm gonna give you a suggestion that I would suggest to my own family and friends for a little bit more, you'll get that much more of an experience and that is gold star service. Right here, what you're looking at folks, this is the upgrade option. This is the premier upper level. As you can see on the left-hand side, the glass dome ceiling, and really you have that true full, huge round, 360 degree view of those beautiful snow-capped mountains in the gold glass dome ceiling car itself. Now you do also have reserve seating. There's an outdoor viewing platform when you upgrade to Gold Star Service. Meals are included when you're in Gold Star Service, whereas in Adventure Class, they're available, but at an additional charge. So if you do upgrade to Gold Star Service, meals are included. You do also have your, pr your own private bar and two complimentary drinks are included, not to mention you have your own private tour guide as you travel from one iconic destination to another. So definitely consider, ask one of our rail experts or your local travel advisor to tell you more if you were to upgrade to Gold Star Service. Now, how is Alaska Railroad maintaining a safe environment? Well, just like here in the United States and the continental US with Amtrak vacations, as well as in Canada and around the world, facial coverings are required okay on board the trains as well as at the train stations passengers and staff have them so obviously as of right here right now today facial coverings are required so for any of you that are looking to travel as early as in the next uh, couple months keep these components in mind also staggered boarding processes so if you don't want to be in a large crowd or a big group of folks they will board you individually and separately from one another just allowing for more room they also have changing seat configuration allowing for more space in between passengers and speaking of space trends are trains are currently running at 50 percent uh, capacity as of right now on purpose okay again just to allow more room between passengers and they also have an increased cleaning and sanitation process going on right now i want to say every hour upon the hour they're cleaning they're sanitizing the handles the doorknobs okay the insides the outsides of the trains folks you can even check in luggage two bags are allowed per person all right so lots to see and do now folks let me move into our most popular package of the different packages I'm gonna highlight here today. This is called our adventure, Alaska Adventure with Alaska Railroad. Nine days, eight nights. And if you look at the map, everyone, this will serve as a good example for the other trips that I'm gonna highlight here today. Two nights in Denali National Park, folks, okay? Two nights in Denali National Park. So again, you don't have to take a five hour bus ride from the, the cruise line and then have to head back at the end of the day, back on the ship. You actually get to overnight for two nights, one in Talkeetna, four in Anchorage, and then one in Seward. Let me walk you through this fantastic package. And again, we're gonna start out with Anchorage. Anchorage is Alaska's largest city. Now you have the option obviously uh, to fly into Anchorage if you choose, or even Fairbanks. We pretty much book everything for you with the exception of flights. So if you want, you're certainly more than welcome to book your flights or your local travel advisor can book not only the package, but also your round trip flights, making it nice and easy for each and every one of you. Now we have a wide selection of hotels to choose from in Anchorage as well as throughout all of Alaska. So again, depending on if you prefer a three, four or five star hotel, a three, four or five diamond hotel. And many of the hotels in Anchorage also provide free shuttle service uh, from the airport to the hotel. Now, some of the great attractions you're gonna see and spend time at on this particular tour, not only Anchorage, but Seward. It's actually the only package where you get to overnight in this great area, okay? And as you can see, definitely has that, those beautiful iconic lodges that you'll have an opportunity to stay at, which is amazing. What's real nice is you also will be treated for a Kanai 
Fjord National Park Cruise. All right, this is a lot of fun. A lot of people always enjoy this. This is actually ranked as the number one wildlife and glacier cruise. It's a half a day trip and you will have a local tour guide during your journey on board uh, the boat cruise itself, all right? And it does also include lunch as well. Now, one of my favorite little areas, and I'm sure it'd be for many of you, it's such a charming town itself, charming little town. This is Talkeetna. Uh, this is known as the gateway to Denali National Park. And what's great with Talkeetna is when you're there, you'll get a chance to go experience some of those local little iconic country stores. They got some great little breweries and little shops and restaurants that you can also head to. But before you know it, it's over into Denali National Park. Do you know there's over 6 million acres, folks? 6 million acres at Denali National Park. And of course, one of the most iconic sites, not only in Denali National Park, but around the world, is Mount McKinley, over 20,000 feet high. Now, you'll be treated for a full day guided tour. So you will be with a local park ranger, and it's a lot of fun. It's a, it's almost a in a, in a school bus style uh, touring, uh, and it's really that rustic feel when you are there. Now, it's a full day. When I say full day, you're going to leave around 6 to 7 a.m. in the morning, folks, okay? They'll leave right from your lodge, right from your lodge itself, and they'll make a couple stops along the way, and then it's on the journey into Denali National Park. Now, you go deep into the park, folks. I want to say you go close to 100 miles into uh, Denali National Park, but it is fantastic, all right? And they'll make stops along the way, of course, to take photos, videos, pictures, lunches also at leisure. In uh, Actually, it's included, rather, during your tour. And this is a real treat as well. And I will mention, we also stay at Denali Cabins as well, which is only about eight miles away from the park entrance of Denali National Park. And many of these cabins and lodges. Many of them do have restaurants inside the lodges as well. Now, for any of you that are interested not only in Denali, Talkeetan, and Anchorage, but also Fairbanks, well, then you may want to consider a Denali National Park with Alaska Railroad starting in Fairbanks. As you can see, we spend two nights in this great city. Now, Fairbanks, known as the Golden Heart City and the gateway for the far north, they call this, all right? So you'll have a chance to spend time here if you choose. It's a lot of fun. And I will mention, I know I touched on it earlier, Denali National Park, when you are there, the cabins that we stay at, uh, not only are they eight miles away from the park entrance, uh, but they do have full service dining. And what's pretty exciting too is they even have an opportunity if you want to uh, have a lunch during any free days at leisure uh, they can pack a lunch for you if you want to go on a hiking trip uh, maybe do a little fishing on your own if you choose it really is a, a great experience and the lodge itself um, just a, a quaint little lodge not you know, not one of the iconic huge lodges that you may find in some of the other destinations only about 46 cabins folks 46 cabins. So again, you want a real in-depth tour of Alaska. Some of these packages are great packages to choose from. And I know we touched on Talkeetna as well, just a charming little village and town with great little shops and restaurants. Now, for some of you who may want uh, more of a little getaway or a shorter trip, a little less expensive, well then consider our highlights of Alaska. And I will mention too, folks, all the pricing that you see on these packages, these the pricing is based in double occupancy, so per person, two to a room, all right? But we do have single rates available, so for any of you looking to travel as a single or solo traveler, we have you covered. And again, this goes to Seward, just a great area that you'll spend time with. And uh, actually, uh, interestingly enough, it's actually located on the edge of Resurrection Bay, uh, voted as one of the top sites by National Geographic. And speaking of Resurrection Bay, folks, you will be treated for a boat cruise on this particular package. Again, similar to the Kenai Fjord tour, this also is a half a day boat cruise with a local tour guide uh, and lunches included. And I will mention too, all of our different trips, not only here in Alaska, but also throughout Canada, Europe, right here in the continental US and around the world, all of our trips, folks, are what we call independent style vacations, flexible, independent travel. So what does that mean? 
unlike a traditional uh, escorted bus tour, right? Where from six to eight in the morning, it's breakfast. From eight to 12, it's sightseeing. From 12 to two, it's lunch. From two to five, it's more sightseeing. From five to seven, it's dinner. From 7 p.m. on, there's an evening activity, and that is most days on an escorted bus tour. You see, folks, our trips are all independent style vacations. So what does that mean? On certain days, such as this one, you have a half a day boat cruise with a local tour guide, okay, with lunch included, but then you have the remainder of the day at leisure. Or in some days, like Denali National Park, you will have a full day guided tour, but then on the next day, you have a free day. So if anybody wants to do a little hiking or fishing um, or just go into the main part of town and, and do a little shopping, all right, and experience some of the local little iconic restaurants, you get to do that. It's really the best of both. You have enough, enough structure, but also enough freedom and flexibility. Now, the last trip that I'll highlight, folks, is really one that's exactly what it says. It is Denali Express with Alaska Railroad. So again, just a short little quick getaway. Again, for those of you that may uh, only be able to travel for a certain amount of time or, or uh, trying to stay within a certain price point, definitely consider this. And I will mention all of our trips that do include Anchorage does include an Anchorage trolley tour, which, you know, again, when we talk about independent style vacations, this is another example of that where you get to travel on board the trolley, the driver, he or she is also your tour guide. All right. And they make stops along the way. You can get out, take some photos, take some pictures. It's really a lot of fun. And uh, you'll get a chance to, of course, see all those great float planes, okay? I remember reading a statistic recently um, that said of all the residents in Alaska, I wanna say uh, two out of every 10 residents in Alaska actually have his or her own pilot's license. Imagine that folks, two out of 10 residents in Alaska actually has his or her own pilot's license. Why? Because it's such a vast state in the United States. And by the way, I remember seeing a video years ago. Some of you may have even seen the same video. I'm smiling as I've I'm, as I'm shared it with all of you. And it showed a husband and wife and they were golfing in Alaska. And then all of a sudden it showed up at the top. It said, the only place in the world you can start golfing, start at 9 p.m. in the evening, folks, all right? Start golfing at 9 p.m. in the evening. Why? There's daylight pretty much around the clock. In fact, I remember being there. I had the pleasure. I've had the pleasure of traveling to Alaska a few times. Um, and in the evening, folks, sometimes, honestly, you just got to close the shades uh, in your lodge or your hotel room, all right, just to get a good night's rest because it truly is daylight most of the time, especially in the summertime into the fall, which is really the best time and the most iconic time to be there. I will also mention, too, again, when you go on the Denali full day guided tour, there's a picture folks on the bottom left-hand corner, really giving you that rustic experience. And again, your driver, um, you also have a local park ranger. Lunch is included, as you can see on the right-hand side. Bring your cameras, bring your iPhones, your mobile devices, right? Um, your video camcorders. This is truly one of the most iconic sites in the world that I have ever seen. And folks, I've been in the industry over 25 years. I've traveled all over the world in Alaska, is one of my top three most favorite destinations. So as I mentioned, $300 off per couple. Folks, if it is on your wish list, your bucket list, again, as I mentioned, all that's due for any of you interested is just that minimal small deposit of only $250. Now, as I mentioned, Rail Bookers not only travels to Alaska, not only Canada, but folks, we also go all over the world, including Europe. As you can see here, here's a map of Europe. So if this is on your wish list for 2021 or even 2022, folks, we have you covered because we have partnerships with all the major train lines throughout all of Europe. So we can book all types of classes of service, not, all, not only in Europe, but also, as I mentioned, even in Alaska from adventure class to gold star service. We partner with many of the luxury trains in Europe, many of the high speed trains, but the biggest highlight I truly think that I could share with all of you here today is our maximum flexibility offer. So again, for any of you that may have joined us a little bit later, or if you've been on since the beginning, folks, any new reservation that you make, again, only $250 deposit per person, 
anytime from today until September 30th of this year. So you have plenty of time to think about where you may want to go. Or for those of you who just want to go somewhere, do you know 75%, 75% folks of our new reservations we are getting from all of the great travelers out there like yourselves and our travel advisors, 75% of them are actually planning to travel in the late summer and fall of this year and the remainder into 2021 in the US, let me say, whether it's Alaska or whether it's in the continental US. And again, when you book with a small deposit of $250 per person, you have the flexibility if you did need to change your date, postpone your trip for whatever reason it is, okay? and we will waive any and all change and cancellation fees. So folks, why do travelers love rail bookers? Again, as I mentioned, you can book up to two years in advance, 24 months, or literally within the next two to three months, they have bucket list experiences. So again, if you're traveling for a special occasion, we have you covered. Freedom and flexibility, again, daily departures throughout Alaska. It truly is a scenic way to travel, especially getting real in-depth of Alaska. Again, deposit now pay later. And you can make payments along the way. Folks, I do a trip every year myself with my own family. We do one rail trip a year. I'm a family of five, my wife and I and our three children. Once I deposit, I always make payments. I do it on my own. Usually every one to two months, I'm making a payment. The next one to two months, I'm making a payment. The next one to two months, I'm making a payment. That's how I do it. You obviously can uh, pay however you prefer. But again, I find that works to be very easy. You could choose your own accommodations, again, between three, four, up to five star, five diamond hotels. And any of these trips, even the ones I highlighted here today, if you want to add extra nights in any of these uh, beautiful parks, if you want to uh, take out a night or add an additional stop or a sightseeing uh, journey, any trip can be customized. And what I always say is, you don't have to take my word for it, folks. Here's some of our happy customers that have traveled on rail bookers. If you look to the left, Using Rail Booker has made it simple to experience so many different areas and beautiful landmarks all in one trip. I like the one in the bottom. It took one call to book the perfect itinerary. Rail Bookers is always our first choice for rail trips. And of course, our trip was a success before we even left home. I love these testimonials. And folks, I know each and every one of you would be happy as well. And again, as I mentioned, if you have a local travel advisor, pick up that phone, book through your local travel advisor who also can book round trip flights for you as well as the entire package. Now you can go online, railbookers.com and view any of these exciting trips, but the best way folks is actually just picking up the phone and giving us or your local travel advisor a call. And as I mentioned, we go all over the world. So not only here in the US with Alaska by land and Alaska by rail, but also all over the world. We've been recognized in many different major travel magazines across the United States as really having some of these great iconic rail journeys. So I did wanna mention folks, definitely don't forget to download the handouts on the right-hand side. Also, any questions that you may have, please feel free to type those in. I did see a couple questions that have come in as well, but folks, before I answer any questions you may have, all right, if you'd be so kind folks, all right, I'm going to give everyone a minute or two on the right-hand side of your screen. And thank you so much for your participation. Folks, what destination are you the most interested in visiting? If it's Alaska, type Alaska. And also, when are you looking to travel to Alaska? So I'm going to give everyone a minute or two. If you'd be so kind to just type in on the right-hand side of your screen, folks, what destination are you the most interested in visiting and when? All right, so if it's Alaska, when are you looking to travel, folks, to Alaska? Is it as early as the late summer and fall of this year? Is it in 2021 and beyond? All right, you let us know, and this just helps us to help each and every one of you. All right, I'm seeing lots of great games. I'm seeing Alaska's all throughout uh, the answers. I'm seeing, oh, great, uh, Grand Canyon, National Parks, Vietnam and Thailand, fantastic. Yep, uh, Austria, Switzerland, Europe. For 2021, fantastic folks. You know, we, again, we go all over the world, not only right here in Alaska, but again, if Alaska is on your wish list, if it's on your bucket list, and again, maybe some of you were originally planning to go by cruise and it got canceled, or maybe um, it was something you were looking at, and now this is another great option. I'll tell you, talk about a great option, alternative suggestion and that's Alaska by land, all right? And we got you covered. And again, as I mentioned, all the train travel 
on board the train is during the day. So folks, I'm gonna open it up to any questions that you may have, okay? And as I'm going through these questions, folks, if any of you have any additional questions um, or wanna, or if you haven't asked any questions, please feel free to type those in. I just wanted to say before I open it up uh, to any of the questions that have come in so far, folks, thank you so much for joining us. Um, we really do appreciate it. Um, as I mentioned, you can give us a call or contact your local travel agent. We are open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, okay, thank you all. Oh, thank you so much, Denise. Thank you, Mary, for your kind words. All right, folks, I am opening up the question box, all right? And I got another few minutes to hopefully uh, help answer any questions that you may have. Thank you, Julie. Yes, <laughs> I do travel with my family. I love it every year, once a year. Thank you, Mario. Uh, Bruce. You're too nice. Thank you. All right. So, okay. Again, deposit. Thank you for asking, Debbie. Deposit's only $250. Debbie's also asking if I can show the maximum flexibility offer again. So let me just go back in my presentation as well. Okay. Uh, just to open that up. Uh, oh, thank you so much, Barbara. Um, so again, folks, this just gives you peace of mind. You're right. All that's due is $250 anytime from today until September 30th of this year. So it gives you time if you do want to, you know, think about or plan a trip in 2021, even into 2022. Obviously, for any of you looking to travel in the next two to three months or the next two to three weeks, uh, obviously give us a call. OK, and you'll still be covered under our maximum flexibility offer. So if you did need to postpone or change your travel dates, uh, we have you uh, covered. Really, again, I always like calling this the peace of mind offer. All right, uh, let's see. Is smoking allowed on board the train? Great question, Don. Uh, smoking is not allowed on board the train, but uh, you are, they do make stops, of course, along the way. And there is an outdoor viewing platform. So certainly if you do upgrade to uh, Gold Star Service, it does have its own outdoor private viewing platform. For a little bit more folks, it's definitely worth uh, the extra because again, your meals will be included and you have your own private tour guide as you're traveling. Uh, on board the train from one great iconic site to the next. So definitely keep that in mind as well. Yep, luggage. Okay, yep, thanks, Trina. Yeah, luggage, again, you are allowed two pieces of luggage per person, and they they can be up to 50 pounds each, okay? Up to 50 pounds each. And as I mentioned, again, it is a independent style vacation, flexible independent travel. So certain days we do have uh, either a full day or a half a day, you know, guided tour in the case of Denali National Park or a boat cruise that includes a tour with a tour guide for a half a day on certain days, but or, or the Anchorage trolley tour, right? But then other days you'll have free time to explore the city, to explore the park on your own. If you want to go back to Denali, if you want to do a little hiking trip or fishing, we got lots of great options for all of you. So with that in mind, folks, I'm going to give you another minute or two for any questions you have. Thank you, by the way, thank you all so much for your kind words and, uh, and your participation. Folks, more than anything, while I'm waiting for any last minute questions, I hope you enjoyed today's presentation as much as I enjoyed presenting. As I mentioned, folks, I've been in the industry over 25 years, the travel industry in Alaska is one of my top three most iconic destinations I've ever traveled to and I've traveled all over the world. All right, so if it's on your wish list, if it's on your bucket list, we got you covered. And the beautiful part is you really get a true in-depth tour of Alaska with rail bookers. So folks, our phone number is listed in the bottom right-hand corner. Again, you can call us or contact your local travel advisor. More than anything, thank you all so much for joining us. I hope each and every one of you have a great rest of the week. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you uh, so much, Steve. Um, I hope you all have a great rest of the week. And uh, we'll look forward to having you, your friends and family on board soon with rail bookers. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.